All right, let's get moving. We got about 2,000, so we got about 6,000 versus 1,500, so let's see what we can do here. If we can take Umbar, the war for Umbar and the Corsair threat is eliminated, snuffed out before it can be rear its ugly head and we have to fight a long series of battles for this area my <coughs> my sneak attack worked <coughs> all right so um i want to break the walls down right here so let's pull you back to the extent of your range This is going to require a lot of men and some um, chef units up front. So fall the corrupt. You will stay behind. The true killing power of this army is the infantry in this battle and the pikes. A long, drawn-out battle does not suit me. I need to overwhelm them with sheer numbers and force. And I have the numbers and the force to do it. Right. Let's see how much of an impact my catapults will have on the walls. Wish they could assault their respective places. Good. So we're gonna break the walls here and we'll probably shoot for over here as well. We'll break here and here. If we can keep them off the walls. Okay. So I'm gonna do a tactic. If they're not right up against the walls. So let me see if they are. Oh, they are. They're right behind. Okay, never mind. I was like, because if they're not right up against there, we can actually pull back. Yeah, those towers are doing a number on us. We're almost in. Should be almost in. We've breached our enemy's walls. Perfect. All right. You dislodge that tower. Right, they're advancing. Nine percent? Jesus, they made those towers strong. But if we can knock some of these towers out, that'll be to my advantage. That one's going to be crucial. And the gatehouse towers. Come on, one more. If we can get one of those knocked out, that'll be plenty. One of those towers will be plenty. <clears throat> Let me do something real quick. I'm not going to cut that out. All I did was turn the fan on. Because there's two ballistas right there firing simultaneously. Because what I'll do is I'll just go this away. No, we're destroying deeper into the city. Right. In. You. Stay on the outside. Do the same. 75%. Dang it.
pull up. There's only one, two, three towers that can shoot you. That one will shoot that unit. But once we're in, there won't be that many that can shoot you. You two pikemen, go that direction. You all attack the gate. Our strength is our numbers, and we must use it to our advantage. Come on, Talon Knights, lead the charge. You're the best unit on the field, you're just not 100%. Oh, they're just gonna do that. Let them have it. That was idiotic. There's one way in. Attack with our elites. Move you up. You should be dying a whole lot quicker than that. We have the numbers advantage. Oh yeah, yeah, you should be dying way, way quicker than that. I just don't think it's registered. Look at that armor that they gave them. That is some sweet looking armor. That makes me want to play some AA right there. Look at that arm. It's like a Trojan-esque inspired armor is what it is. Flare out to the left. Alpha lies pikeman. Guard our flank. <clears throat> oh, they're going to th through the port section. Oh, that's cool. Oh, you get to see the actual port port. Okay, okay. So this is not the custom custom battle map. Because the cust there's a custom battle map that they tried to import in, but I guess they never got it to actually work. Go that way. Pikemen are moving to the left. Have we gained a foothold? I think we have. Push through into the left. If we can get those units up onto the walls, that would give us an advantage of height. They're bringing in their reinforcements. Archer militia, Gondoring and infantry, cavalry, archer militia, Gondoring and infantry, uh, just infantry spam, but that's okay. What are you doing, crossbows? Oh, they're trying to get some height on it. If we continue like this, we will smash it. defenders. Crush them. We need to clear this away. Once we clear this away, we can clear all that and then push into the central areas. <clears throat> I got some more infantry coming up. So do we, we need to take control of that gate and push to the gate is what we need to do. Wait for it, get him, what is this? Here? Get him. We've killed 17%. You up onto the walls. You do the same. Up onto the walls. We're keeping us pinned. 
Here comes a flood of infantry from our allies. They lost a lot. Sauron defenders, or South Rome defenders. You turn on to them. Move, 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 move. That's too big of a force. Move up here. Citadel guards moving up. There we go. You got good shots. Turn about. I mean, look at that angle. That's like a perfect angle to shoot them. They'll just do it. <clears throat> bringing up reinforcements. We've crushed all of this. Y'all. Move against them. You shoot them. You turn left. I want you to help overrun all of this. You move up. Move up into here. We've established too much of a corridor. Oh, look at this. They're firing right on top of y'all. Drive them back. The AI is just pressing through with all its might instead of trying to fight. Which is what the AI does in sieges. If it can, it'll just... It'll just keep pressing and pressing and pressing until it breaks the defenses. Got more pikes. Oh, they're just pressing on through. They're just like, nope. Converge. We've killed 41% of them. Crossbows, I guess. Perfect. Without him, his troops will lose their will to fight. We've captured the enemy's walls. We've captured the gateway. All right, all that's fallen. To so move into the center compound. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. Is anybody over here? I don't think so. Oh, that's, that's more Gondorian militia, looks like. Yep. They've all broken. Southron cavalry is breaking. What remains of the royal house of the king's men? is being put to the sword. Have we not? Okay, there it is. <clears throat> you go that direction. Down that way. Here comes the last of our reinforcements entering into the city. Like a conquering army. Because we are a conquering army. Look at that. That is intimidating. Rank upon rank of Gondomian infantry entering in your city. Imagine if you were defending this and all you saw was just <laughs> overrunning the gate and then just moving into the city systematically. Got some defenders in the middle. Troops on the walls. <laughs> I 
Is there anybody over there? I don't think so. Where are all the enemy at? There's one. There's one on the walls over there. I'm not worried about that. I think we killed the other general. Everyone converge. And this will allow us to... Once we seize Umbar, it'll allow us a gateway into this extreme southern lands. Because I can rapidly go eastward. Now, I will have... Re rebellious armies that I'll have to deal with from the Corsairs. But they can't recruit any more troops. They're essentially stuck at what they are. Little clansmen. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Yeah, those aren't the best spearmen, but they are decent spearmen. Oh, that's a big... Cluster, defend, defend, assault, assault. So you lost half of your number. You didn't even lose a, you know, you didn't even lose close to half. And I lost not a half of my number. Well, that's good. Looks like they lost half of their number because of the, yeah, the watch. Got him. Crush what remains of organized resistance. Very simple strategy. Break a chink in their armor and then execute them. And I should have the troops to make this stick. <clears throat> the rebels will be interesting. Now, final bell is going to be a different nut to crack entirely. Mostly because of the Muma kill. Now, Muma kill are terrible in sieges because you can pin them down the city. in city fairways. So. All right. Do I just, yep, yeah, we're just gonna ride out the time. I think we have the time to do it. If we send troops over there, it's gonna be a, more troops dying, so no. I think we got a pretty good contingent of troops. Yep, I think we have control over the city. Except for a small pocket of resistance. If I go over there, I'll lose more men and it won't be worth it. So we're just going to hold our ground. I only had one general. You'll become the Lord of Umbar. And the captains will be sent forth. The legions of Gondorians are powerful. This is why you want to have the United Kingdom. Because it makes your mid to late game so much fun. You could also do it really early in the game. You could have done this at turn 70 if you wanted to. And that would have made for a different campaign. Uh, definitely a way different campaign. Because the AI wouldn't have it built up so strong. It would have allowed you more resources. And possibly allowed you to have done this a lot sooner. And if I had realized that, because this is my first time playing it... If I had realized that, that's what I would have done. But I did not realize that at the time. I like how you can't ninja cap a, uh, a thing. Because that's actually a strategy where you break in, you take control of the central plaza, and then you lock off areas. And then you win off of time. So. Should have enough time. Oh yeah, we, we got plenty of time. Not much more. We got plenty of time. Because there'll be two timers pop up. The end of the battle and us taking it. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Be awed by the